Welcome everybody into today's video. I will be showing you guys the real way and how you can actually get the shark anchor inside of Blocks Roots. So this is actually the real method on how you can get the shark anchor guys. So yeah, I'm gonna get stuck right in. Here's how you can get the shark anchor sword inside of Blocks Roots. And this is probably like the best way on how you can get it out of all of the other ways and how you can actually get the sword out there. So yeah, this is the best way on how you can get the sword. Let's get stuck right in guys. Make sure if you like and subscribe to my channel before we do get started. So yeah, before we do get started, like and subscribe to my channel. Like I said, I'm always doing giveaways on my channel where I'm giving away thousands of free rulebooks if you guys do want to get yourself any fruit there. Uh, maybe you want to go ahead and get yourself fruit like leopard. Maybe you guys want to go ahead and get yourself mammoth fruit. Whatever fruit you guys want there, uh, comment what fruit you want and I'll give it to you for free. Permanently, by the way. So, as you can obviously see, I do have leopard fruit permanently. If you guys want the same, basically comment if you want it or not. And I'll give it to you for completely free. As long as you like and subscribe to my channel. Or maybe you want some of the new fruits, love the sink fruit. So yeah, just comment what you want, guys. And I'll give it to you for completely free. But anyway, let me show you guys how you can get the shark anchor sword inside of Black Fruit. Alright, guys. So first things first, here's what you need to do. So you basically need to go to the new sea. If you guys are wondering where the new sea is, obviously you should know where the new sea is. But yeah, once you guys are in the new sea, where you then want to go is to the NPC, where you can actually craft um, the new accessories. I did do a location video on that, so if you want to know where that is, watch this video. That it should be on the screen right now. And yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the Shark Hunter NPC. I'll just put the picture of the video for I done on where the NPC is right now. And here's where you guys can go to get to the NPC to craft these accessories. So yeah, here's the accessories that you need. So basically, here's what you need to do. So you need to craft three accessories. As soon as you craft three accessories, you then can go ahead and get this sword. But you have to do a certain method on how you get the sword. So here's what you need to do guys. So basically craft one tooth necklace. I will put the tooth necklace on the screen right now. So craft one tooth necklace. Do that right now. Soon as you craft one tooth necklace, I will now show you guys the other thing that you need to do. You need to craft one tarot draw. I will put the tarot draw recipe on the screen right now as well. And we've also got the monster magnet. So make sure you um, obviously make those three accessories. It's going to take a while for you to get all of the parts to actually make the, this accessory. But something what you guys can do is go to items and just trade people for like shark tooths and stuff. So yeah, basically grind for recipe ingredients that you need. And as soon as you got those three items, guys, a lot of people don't say what you need to do next. You gotta equip them. So equip them accessories. If you do not equip them, it don't work. A lot of other YouTubers just said you need to get the items. And then you can actually get the sword, but that's not true. Equip those accessories. And now what you need to do, guys, is defeat the terror shark. So it's gonna it can take you a few hours. It could you could get on your first try. You could get on your hundredth try. You gotta grind the terror shark. Keep on killing the terror shark over and over and over again until you get the sword from a drop. So it's a very small chance of you actually getting the sword from the drop. But as you can see on the screen right now, that is how you get it. So yeah, if I do remember to, I'll put a screen, well, picture on the um, screen right now of what you actually, what it looks like when you kill it. So basically keep on killing the tarot shark with those accessories that I specifically told you. As soon as you do that, there's a very, very small chance of you actually getting the shark anchor from killing the tarot shark. So basically just go ahead guys and just keep on killing the tarot shark until you get the sword in a drop like I did say four multiple times already it can take you five hours one hour it could take you one minute it can take you a, a week month it's just down to your luck guys 
because you can become really really unlucky and you can keep on killing this Terror Shark and it just won't drop for items so it's all down to luck guys you gotta keep on killing them Terror Sharks over and over and over again until you actually get from a drop guys so yeah just a recap basically go to the NPC I did do a video on that craft the items that I told you with the ingredients that I also showed you as soon as you craft those, you will then be able to kill the Tyro Shark. If you're wondering how you kill the Tyro Shark, I did also do a video on that. So if you want to go ahead and watch that video where I showed you how you can actually kill the Tyro Shark, I did do a video on that. So you can actually just go ahead and watch it right now, guys. Okay. So yeah. At the end of the day, though, that's how you actually go ahead and get the new sword anchor inside of Blocks Root. So yeah, just follow that method. That I showed you there, and by following that method, you'll go ahead and get that sword. If I do remember to, I'll put a little showcase on what the sword's like. If you guys think it's worth getting or not, I am just gonna say it is worth getting. It's a really cool looking sword, so I'm gonna be brutally honest here. And yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, guys, that is going to be everything I wanted to show you. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, this video helped you guys out. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel with notifications on. I did save a small part of times already, but I'm always doing videos on my channel. But I'm giving out fruits. Like, generally, if you need any fruit, uh, I'll give it to you for free, such as rumble fruit, any of the new fruits, leopard fruit. Comment what fruit you want, and I'll give it to you for free. But anyway, guys, there's everything I wanted to show you. Hopefully, this Black Roots video helped you guys out. And yeah, I mean, I guess we'll all now see you on the very next video. But yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. That's been how you get the shark anchor inside of Blocks Roots. And yeah, and I'll catch you all in the very next video. Peace out, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And yeah, and I'll see you all in the very very next video peace out guys thank you so much for watching please make sure that you guys have notifications on though because i'm pretty much love on youtube is doing videos like this so yeah please guys have notifications on and yeah that's pretty much everything i wanted to show you but like i did say please have notifications on guys as i'm always doing videos like this on my channel but yeah i know see you all in the very next video peace out guys